Hello everyone and welcome back to the pretty sure this is the tenth episode now. We're finally on episode number ten. It's been almost two months now since I started the series, but yes, I'm finally on episode ten. And in the last episode, from what I recall, because it's been a while since I recorded, I what is it called? We finished, you know, conquering Sudwest Africa. So now we're going to continue to push into the other German colonies. Now, I did get a lot of comments about how I should increase anti-tank and anti-air production, and I just want to show you guys this. So, as South Africa, on hard mode, you get lots of debuffs to production. As you can see, uh, where is it? Somewhere here, but, um, I think... I'm not sure if it has to do with the South African War, but basically, I get a massive reduction in production capability. Also, another thing is, since I'm a service by requirement, because if it's such high casualties, that's another minus 30% to production efficiency. So even with five factories on basic anti-tank, it would still take me... Let's take a little look, see? This is anti-tank. It would take me... 1,000 days to produce it. Also, another thing is, I totally forgot to be producing anti-air this entire time. So we're going to have to produce some of that. And I'm going to take a little bit off guns. And as you can see, I have 30 factories on guns, yet I'm only producing 36 a day. So we're going to have to take a little bit off that, and we'll put... No, we're not going to get the new anti-tank, because we want to try and produce as much as possible. Put a little bit more in that, and a little more in that. All right, let's see. What is what do we have left to do? We can do this stuff. All right, let's do that. Okay. Let's buy some guns. Do that. Let's get that. Let's see if we can get any more guns or just anything in general. That's not too bad. Um, mm -hmm. so chaos. Ah, here we go. So we could buy anti-tank. We could buy rifles. Um, hmm. Yeah, we definitely need more manpower. Wait a second. This does... No, we just want... We just want the good... Last waltz music. I don't know if this is too loud or not. Let me just take a little look. See, nope. I think that this is okay. Let me just make it a little bit quieter. Yep, that should be good. That should be good. Let's see. What do we want to listen to? Yeah, let's listen to float. Ominous. All right, let's see. What were we doing? So, because I'm just trying to reacquaint myself. Okay, so they've got about 8 to 12 visions, and I still have 38, so I can probably get off some encirclements. So, let's see if we can go here. Maybe what we can do is we can try and pin this guy here. And we'll try and hold there. We're almost done there. Maybe what I could do is I could have this guy go up around here. Have that guy go there. Have that guy go take Leopoldville. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Let's go down a four speed and on pause and see what happens. Three military factories. Oh, okay. Um, put it on that then. Actually. Oh my god. I've only got. Tw oh my god, wow. Spending a lot of time rebuilding things. Italy joins the OFN. Okay. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Then circle now. Good, good, good. You know what? You don't go because you have no org. Sorry if I'm, not, if I'm not talking too much. I'm just trying to focus and remember what exactly I was doing. Mm -hmm. 
I'm just trying to get off some encirclements, and then I'm thinking that maybe what I can do is once I get off just a few more encirclements, and there's practically no one left, I can just front line this. But it's actually kind of scary sounding. But to be fair, that's almost all the music in, in uh, what is it called? In the new order. Now, let's see, let's see, what's going on here? Oh, we're paused. Actually, you know what, let's, let's increase the speed just a little bit. Oh, wow, that, that thing has... Let's just, let's just go like that and see what happens. How is this guy still alive? Oh, because I'm using militia to kill him, and militia have no ward. More military factories? Let's just set them all to produce those. is looking pretty good actually. And then we're gonna get that motorized. We'll just clean up that pocket. Damn it. We can't let that motorized escape. Damn it, he's gonna escape. Oh, nice, we got the overrun. Okay, we got the overrun. <laughs> okay, that's good. That doesn't help us at all either. You know, I feel like the game sort of is assuming that I have won this, the war by now, but I haven't because I'm playing on hard mode. Ho, 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 German tank. If we can get all four of these guys, I think we might be able to steamroll that tank because there's some mountaineers in there. You go up to Dilolo. You can. You go help. Actually, no, you stay, because you really might need your help with that guy. Good, good, good. Six to nine divisions. All right, I'm just going to see if I can kill this German tank, and then we're going to battle front uh, line this. Or front line, not battle line. I don't know what I'm talking about. Also, what even is in this German tank? Actually, that's that's really not the best tank in the whole gosh darn world. All right, you guys get him. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. This is good. This is good. Our time has almost come. Get this guy? I know you can. Ah, okay. Once we get once we get this once we get this German tank, we'll no, nope. what are you what are you guys doing? Let me just try to assign you guys and have you guys just stop. Reorg and kill that tank. Oh wait, the German the tank is about to be disorganized, and then it won't have... Alright, now go. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. What the heck is this music? I've never heard of this one before. Path of Danger. I can't even find... Oh, there it is. Huh, I've never listened to this one before. Interesting. get this guy. Oh, that guy's attacking too. Ho, ho, ho. We could get a double encirclement here. That would be nice. See how far? How, okay, so we still got a ways to go to capitulate these guys, but once we've taken out two more divisions, 
should be good. Okay, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, because now, as you can see, we don't even need equipped divisions. We just need, like, a bunch of divisions to help encircle. And okay, we've now pretty much finished the focus tree. So I'm going to stop taking focuses so that we can increase our political power. Because that would be very useful. Let's, uh, let's, uh, let's take a little look-see. Let's see how the world is doing. Um... Yeah, so the world is actually, this is kind of a boring world, not gonna lie. Um, let's take a look, say, can, we, let's see what passive bonuses we can get. That's ahead of time. That doesn't really help us, because we have basically no anti-tank in our entire divisions, but, eh, it's better than nothing. Just get rid of that, get rid of that. Why don't we just get rid of all of these things, because... I could care less. We've got ooh, tons of divisions here. Yep, that's great. I'm glad that we got resistance to the occupation. All right, all right. Oh, I never picked up a research. Let's get that one, whatever. Nice, nice. We've got like no stability, no war support, no nothing. <laughs> We've got nothing. <laughs> we just gotta keep attacking this guy. Just keep on attacking. Just, just come on. Oh, nice. Okay, so we got, we got that guy. Chemical weapons. What? Huh. Wow. Okay. Uh, wait a second, what? Did the US just peace out with someone? Oh my god. They did. They peaced out with Central Africa. Now they're only war with Ost Africa. Or maybe they declared war with Ost Africa, so now there's... You gotta be kidding me. I- 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 <laughs> I killed 600,000. I lost 600,000 men. And now you're like, okay, I'ma come now. And take all of your stuff. Alright, just go. Make it aggressive. I don't even care anymore, to be honest. Yeah, I, I could care less. Wow, this is so. This this might actually this might actually be the end of the series this episode because with you know the U.S. and the Italians joining the war, it's pretty much over. Considering that, well, not to be mean or anything, but they have three divisions because I killed all of them. <laughs> oh my god. Also, Italy's got the most divisions out of anybody. It's interesting. Well, no, it's not really interesting. I mean, it's sort of, but not really. This is like, wow. I'm just, I'm just like, why, why couldn't they have done this like, I don't know, like, earlier? Like, it would have been nice. Take some more guns. Oh, whatever. I don't care. Whatever. This is pretty much over. Now they've only got two divisions, of which they're right there. 
Where's actually our motorized? Just go. I don't even care anymore. Just go. Whatever. Everyone join the war. Have fun. Okay, wow, this is... Cool, thanks for the volunteer spin. Nice, we got another overrun. Oh, Australia's gonna send us four to more divisions. Great. Alright, let's see. So, I am still the only person to have taken casualties. The person to have dealt casualties. So, by and large, I had a 2 to 1 KD ratio. Not too shabby, if I do say so myself. Yeah, that was... I think that that was pretty successful. Like, I think I've killed... Oh no, there's still two divisions somewhere. Send that guy over there, whatever. Okay, I know that this is not kind of boring, but literally I'm just sort of sitting here not doing anything. Am I in the Organization of Free Nations now? Oh, I am. Nice. This is not too bad. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Can this please? Can we just end the pain and suffering now? Please? Pretty please? With the cherry on top? Oh, no, I thought I thought somebody was going to capitulate. How close are they? Oh, they're so close. So close. That is just thick right there. Look at that thick South Africa. Look at it. Look at it. Nice, and it's so commitment. Nobody in it. Nice, we took... What the heck? Is that a rocket? Did the Rex Commissariat of West Africa have rockets? I think I, I, think I have to play one of these Rex Commissariats. I have to see what this is all about. Like, this is just, this is just, I don't, I don't know. Can you like set up booby traps and stuff? That'd be pretty cool. Hitler stopped. Yeah, wow, this is just, just amazing. You know, I kind of went. Oh wow, eight thousand. Let's see, what is our equipment in the field? Yeah, oh my god, wow, it's fifty-one percent. I wonder how much like war material is like physically destroyed in this war. Also, like, how much longer can you possibly take to capitulate? No law. Please tell me that that's them capitulating. Please tell me that that's them capitulating. Please tell me that that's them capitulating. Oh my god, I think that they're finally capitulating, guys. Oh. No, it's just, it's just that. Actually, by and large, let's see what, let's see what traits we got on these generals. Because I, I haven't really looked at generals at all. Oh, wow. He's got jungle rat, hill fighter, and desert fox. And he's about to have himself Fortress Buster. This guy is one thick general. Let's see, what's this guy? Yeah, that's useless. This guy also could get adaptable. He's got Mountaineer too. Ooh. Let's see, what's this guy like? Yeah, this guy's pretty good too. We've got some pretty good generals here. Are you telling me that I'm gonna have to take Zanzibar? There's no physical way for me to take Zanzibar. I don't know what they want me to do. Like, I, I, I can't do that. <laughs> oh my god. Infantry anti-air. We're in 1967 now. Wow, this, 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 is, this has been fi- Wait. Oh, okay. I was, I was just gonna say, did I forget to do my military doctrine? Because I was gonna say, I'd be pretty mad at myself if I forgot to do military doctrine. Because that is like the most important thing in this game. Oh my god. 
Please tell me that when I take this tile, they can capitulate. Romania goes into isolation. I don't care. Oh my god. What is this? Do I have to, like, literally take every single tile? Like, what the heck? What the heck is that place? Who are you at war with? Oh. Russia. Yeah, I don't I don't I don't even I don't even wanna know anymore. Okay, so let's see. The West Russian Revolutionary Front. Oh, Omsk. Good job, Omsk. Proud of you. No, not really. So it seems like all of the authoritarian socialists did pretty well. Oh, these guys. Who are these guys? Dust box. Russian. Air, oh, yes, finally. Okay, so. It appears as if we need to take Zanzibar. Oh, I got an idea. I'm just gonna take this one stupid rinky dink marine division and he's gonna go there. And he's gonna get to have fun. Also, we've got lots of generals. Damn. Damn. Oh, I totally forgot we had a panzer leader. That probably would have been useful now that you think about it. Uh, let's give Phil Hewn the uh, chance to take this naval invasion. What? Why did you... S no. There you go. Okay. <laughs> I was just about to say, can I please have the naval invasion, like, happen? It'd be pretty nice. Because, like, why did they have to make it like this? Where you have to literally take every single state. Like, every single state. Like, ah, 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 ah. Let's see, do we have a truck? Yeah, let's get a truck. Oh, great. Oh my god, can I please just finish the game? Please. Please. I feel like a lot of the games that I play are just me, like, sort of pain and suffering. Let's see. Oh my god, we're at 23 minutes. Can I please just... Great. Do we have a navy? Please tell me we have a navy. Yes, we have 29 ships. Okay. Um... Do it. Go faster. We have an early battleship? What the heck? Uh, yes. 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 It's over. It is over. It truly was a mark of the modern precedent of warfare to bear witness to the battle which stressed fiercely into the night. Just hours ago, the march of the infantrymen was coupled with the gasps and sputters of tanks treading through the African bush. Trudging through as the mud and grass, as well as any pair of legs or treads could do. Finally, as the men approached the compound, the sickening relief had dawned upon them. This was it. The war would be over, uh, would be over after tonight. And nary a soul had the strength to care about how many would have to die in order to destroy the Reich's commissariats for once and for all. Hours into the artillery strikes, however, the true face of butchery would alight as soldiers rushed beyond the setting sun to meet the strength of the African and the American. 
The gunfire lasted for hours, the sunmen beginning to bleed, strictly from their destroyed eardrums. Rifles, machine guns, anti-tank rifles, anti-aircraft emplacements, artillery barrages, tank shells, even flamethrower units had been used to destroy as much as possible and fight to the bitter end. Trenches hardly did a man good as dirt and gore and limbs were cat uh, catapulted into the sky from nearby explosions. While men shouted trying to gain advantage over the enemy, all manner of soldiers descended upon the final battle as Americans and Africans, both white and black, met their mocked Schutzstaffel and mercenaries in this final stand, some only leaving bones behind in the aftermath of the gunfire and decimation. However, eventually, the Germans broke back. After the frigid African night... Wait, what? Whatever. Descended upon them, and it was only then that the compound remained vulnerable. However, as light descends upon the world of sin, so too does the rising sun bathe the men of war. No longer was the African continent plagued with a German plague. Finally, victory had been achieved with no rights commissar to say otherwise, with everyone dearly enchanted with thoughts of the future. A bold new future awaits us. The war is won, my friends. We have done it. After many long, tedious hours, and my sanity wavering, we have won this war. It may have come at a, at a great human cost, and it may have come at the cost of many military equipment. We have not wavered. We have stood true. We have stood the test of time, and we have come out victorious. The dark continent will be dark no more. Let the light shine upon the African continent for a better future. Good day, my friends. And let peace ring out across the world. <laughs>